Oh crap, where's my celebration CTV? Oh crap, I forgot to put a little latency. Well, if anybody's here, say hi. I'm gonna grab my ETV. Hey. Hey, how you doing? Ah, <sighs> Aaron Scott, good to see you. I've had food poisoning or uh, stomach bug for a few days, so I'm looking pretty rough. Uh, I was just trying to go live on OnlyFans, but the site wasn't working well. But we got some celebrations. Last, hey, last. <laughs> uh, I think I forgot to do ultra low latency, but it looks like there's five of you in here. So we'll get started. Oh, hey, it was good seeing you today too, Brandon. I'm just opening some celebrations. Yeah, I ran out of there. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I uh, ran out of there, ran to work. Then I had to go buy a bunch of food for work. <laughs> it's been quite the day. Quite the day, but I'm happy to be here with you guys. Like seeing how many viewers show up. I know I didn't really plan this, but uh, we got a whole bunch of juicy packs right here. We're gonna dive right in. Start with the battle styles. Oh, I look rough, huh? Oh, oh. <laughs> I need to take some time for myself. Indeed, I need like a vacation pad, but. I'm not going to get one until January. I already know it because we're going to be busy. We are, oh, I got a white coat card out of Battle Styles. That's unusual, as you know. <laughs> I hope these are all juicy packs. We're trying to pull that Zard from Celebrations. Ooh, you found the gold Mew from Mini Tim, but it's off center. That's a bummer, but at least you got the gold Mew. You can check that one off your checklist. We got Golbat, Bruno. I'm super excited to see whatever this white code card is leading to but yeah those mini tins are, have incredible pulls uh i have a lot of people saying that they've had good pulls from them. only a few people saying they've had good bad pulls so i personally got good pulls from them. i got you know birthday pikachu i got mew ex i got um you know some good oh we got the uh full art stetland v oh hello what is your my favorite set out right now i mean i would say right now it's got to be celebrations Oh, no problem. It was good to see you. I'm glad you popped in. Yes, you get to see me live. Hello. I'm so happy to see you. Yes, Stoutland V. That's the first pull of the night. That is looking pretty good. Oh, I found a bunch of Vivid Voltage at Walmart. Oh, you got the Charizard from your ETV? Well, I'm hoping to get the Charizard from mine. So this is just the beginning. This is, I've only opened that one pack. We got a white code card out of Vivid Voltage. This could be like a loaded box right here, huh? Ooh, I'm feeling good about it. Well, congrats on your Zard. Congrats on your Golden Mew. Oh, I'm liking those positive vibes. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Happy to hear that. Got this little elephant. Got this Yanbo. Golarian Meowth. Duskull, right in time for Halloween. Yes, bring that fire. We got that Voltorb. We got Reverse Opal, and the hit is Galarian Darumaka. Not a big hit, but it's a hit. Evolving Skies. Oh, you have? Oh, you've pulled that. I've had no, I've had zero luck from Evolving Skies. I haven't pulled a single hit out of Evolving Skies. I've opened a lot. Bronx, you know, it's always good to have you here. I love seeing you. I love seeing your comments on my videos. You always brighten it every Wednesday. Green code card. First green code card, Chilling Rain. Of course it is. Can't say green code cards out of Chilling Rain is surprising. One, two, three, four. Got 
Two alt sets, but you want the sleepy, oh, the sleepy Dragonite. That's quite the card. I'm going to be opening some Japanese booster boxes to try and get that card because those have way better pull rates. Larion, Steeny. So yeah, I um, I want to pull it. I mean, I could just buy it, but I want to pull it. And if I were to buy it, I'd probably buy it in a PSA 9 or 10. I'd buy it already graded. So I wouldn't want to risk getting a high dollar junk card. Larvesta, Diglett, and a Bomb of Snow. Yes, you do. And it shows. So we got Darkness of Blaze. We actually have two Darkness of Blaze packs. So we're going to hope to get, um, you know, that Charizard. But it's not happening in this pack. Oh, yes. But yeah, sorry, I forgot to turn on the ultra low latency. It was This is pretty spontaneous. Billowing Smoke, Turbo Batch, Squovit, Spinarak, Larvista, a Baba Snow. Hey Lou, how you doing? <laughs> I know I'm still so sick with the head cold too on top of the stomach bug. Doug Trio and Hippo. Five more cars to complete your celebration set. That's so awesome. I'm like not near that. I think I, well, maybe I am actually. I'm going to have to do a tally and let you guys know like next week when I get off of work. We got a green code card out of that darkness of blaze as well. Unfortunate, but we're moving on to celebrations after this pack. I cannot wait to see what I get. Some sage, building smoke, turbo patch, little baby elephant, Sinistee. Phoebus, Monkey, Bird. We got a Reverse Rare Light Bird. And then, oh, the same card twice. It's kind of, I'd so, I always think it's so weird when that happens. That's the weirdest stuff. Have I gotten hits on Celebrations? I have gotten the Venusaur. I've gotten the Blastoise. I've gotten um, Mew EX. I've got, Hello, Stephen. Good to see you. Hello. I'm so happy so many of you are here. I'm going to get hits. I know it. I got 10 packs out of this ETB for celebrations. I've gotten both white and green code. I was just going to try and do a card trick. That's silly. I've gotten both white and green code cards out of my celebrations. We got your Veltal. Oh, there's one I actually don't have. Garchomp Level X. That's a pretty card too. I didn't even, I wasn't even thinking about this one being a set. So right off the bat, our first celebrations pack, we get this monster hit right there with that beautiful foil pattern to it. That was pretty awesome. And then a Lunala is the last card. All right, I will take that. I will take that, my friends. Oh, feels good. Feels good. And if you guys have any questions for me, definitely leave them in the comments because, of course, I'm reading them. Still need a bunch of common cards and celebrations, but you haven't opened much. How much would you say you open? We got the Cosmog, Groudon, Zard incoming. Oh, I hope so. I want Zard or Golden Mew and the Professor's Research. That was a dud pack. That was only pack number two. Oh, I need a good hit. Give me that hit. Hype it up. Feel that heat. Yeah, the Zard. Oh, thank you. I'm a mess. I have a food poisoning or a stomach bug. I feel like I look like death. <laughs> but you're so sweet. <laughs> Palkia. Cosmo. Dialga. And, oh, okay, we got a little hit. Zacian V. A, li a little smidge. A little smidge of the heat. I will take that. Oh, <laughs> thank you. You make me blush. I open a lot trying not to buy the last five cards. Yeah, you want to pull them. It's way more fun if you get to pull them. I'm hoping to pull them myself, but if I don't, I will just buy them. But Groudon, Palkia, I think we're going to see Celebration in store for a little while. 20 packs are only Walmart. Oh. Oh, that's awful. And put clear stickers on all the Pokemon. Oh, we got a professor's research. All right. That's, whoa. So, yeah. So, if you live somewhere more rural, it's going to be hard to get Pokemon cards because there's going to be a few people that are just ruining it for everybody. Your friends finish the set? Nice. I mean, it's 50 cards. It's definitely doable for the common person to open, like, maybe 100 packs. 
tops and then probably get all the cards, but it's also not possible. It's possible, but it's not. I wouldn't expect it to happen, but it could happen. So we got a Cosmogs, Reshiram, Cleffa. I've pulled this Cleffa quite a bit out of the set, but that is definitely a nice hit. And then we have a Mew for the last card. So yeah, Cleffa is a fun hit for sure. Just got one Walmart. Everything else over our way. Oh, yeah. So my Walmart, so this is something you guys can keep in mind. The Walmart that I go to that's a bit more rural, I go out of my way to go to an amass. You open only 80 packs. Okay, that's really good for reference. So yeah, it's very possible that somebody could finish this set in 80 packs. I totally see it happening. So yeah, the, this Cleffa, very cute. I love the Neo cards. Still got a few packs to go here. But yeah, I might, so the Walmart that I just went to today, I had a, I got a big hit. I got the Pikachu Ultra Premium Collection. They had ETBs. They had the Rush Ram and Charizard Gold one. I'm going to open that. Oh, hi, Jody. Yeah, you made it. Uh, uh oh, Xerneas. I forgot to turn on the um, low latency. So, ooh, we got Here Comes Team Rocket. I pulled that one a few times too. And a Lunala. Pulled all every star from. And alternative ones, but it took two ETBs and a Pikachu pack with the figure. Okay, so here comes Team Rocket as a hit. And uh, yeah, I wonder how much I've opened. I want to say I've opened at least at least 40 packs. But yeah, unless I got the gold mew. But yeah, the Reshiram and Zard Gold Box. I was so happy to find it. it. Looks like it's doing a lot online. They limited me to two things. So I needed the Ultra Premium Collection. I needed the Zard. I wanted the ETV, but I was like, they take your license at this Walmart and they limit you to two per person. They write down all your info. So I was like, I obviously can't go back in a couple hours later and buy more. Cosmo. See, no, I actually suspected that somebody could complete it in a hundred, hundred packs. So I think it's not impossible. Somebody would have to be really lucky though. First ever, a shiny Mew, no way. Well, congrats, Pokemon Legacy. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, so this is all the celebrations I have. It's just this ETV. We do have three more packs here. Um, Ho and Lugia. Yeah, I love Ho -Oh and Lugia. Okay, let's see if we got. Nope. And all right, all right. Mini hit, mini hit. Wow, they only had one. Yeah, so at some of my GameStops, the employees are buying everything before it hits the shelf. So we're not even getting stuff from GameStop lately at all. Um, Jamie's been looking. I mean, we're our best luck has been Barnes and Noble, rural WalMarts. Uh, not the ones in the cities because the employees, I think, are scalping them. Yeah, thank you so much. I'm glad you made it. Yeah, I'm going to do another one next week. Uh, ooh, we got a clay doll. I was hoping for a stronger hit there, but a clay doll will do. Professor's Research. Hey, AK30, welcome to the party. Good to see you. Boy, let me see. Need your shiny Mew luck, yeah. Hey, I love seeing how many people are popping in. Don't cut the new chairs. Oh, I need the Shining Magikarp. You drive three hours. Whoa, you do? Whoa. Yeah, if you're driving like that, you're... So we got Cosmo, Groudon, Kyogre, and Lunala. So there was zero last pack Magic. Well, let's recap those hits. I gotta open in some more cards before I go, but we got the clay doll. We got this asshole. We got here comes Team Rocket. I do have Yu-Gi-Oh to open. Cleffa. I will open. I got some cool Yu-Gi-Oh like um, older sets, like sets that are like five years old, but I forgot them in my car. We got the Garchomp though, so that is one I needed. We got. Galarian, Darmanitan, and then we got Stoutland V Full Art. That's a really nice looking card. Uh, so that's what I've pulled so far. Oh, thank you. Yes. Subscribe and ring that bell. Yeah, I do have Yu-Gi-Oh. I have, oh, I have this new Pikachu tin I can open too. Pikachu. 
Yeah, but I can open some Yu-Gi-Oh towards the end. I'll probably open this and then some Yu-Gi-Oh. I haven't been in here that long, but I don't know how long I can linger because of my uh, thank you, thank you, because of my stomach. Oh, we got Chunky Chew falling out there. It means it's lucky. We got Vivid Voltage, like my favorite regular set. Vivid Voltage again. Rebel Trash. Oh, we got Burning Shadows and Cinnamon Base. This pack feels funny, so kind of curious what's going to be in there. Am I a Marvel fan? Oh, I like it, but I... Oh, thank you very much. I'm actually moving it to another room uh, very soon. I'm going to be remodeling everything. I'm not really a Marvel fan. Uh, I mean, I like it, but I don't really buy this stuff. I don't dislike it. Oh, we got a white code card. This pack feels like super funny. So I'm curious what's in here. Two, three, four. So yeah, we will uh, be doing more celebrations next week when I go live. I'm not quite sure what day. I'm hoping to do Friday night, but I might do a different night to see if more people can. The new Mario Party is out tomorrow. I know. I need the new Mario Party. Do I buy Japanese cards? Yes, I buy Japanese and Korean. So I'm going to be doing um, live. I'm going to do some Japanese and Korean booster boxes very soon. I actually prefer the Japanese and Korean because the card quality seems to be better than the English lately. And the pull rates are better. So the Japanese ones, the pull rates are way better. Mario Party 37. Oh, man. Yeah, so I am so... I wish I had... I bought Night Unison booster box. Ooh, nice. We got a reverse Simifore. I'm excited for you to get that. Oh, that's why that pack felt funny. It had this chunky boy right there. We got a Darkrai GX out of those tins. Those tins are magic, let me tell you. I love horror movies. I have not seen Hereditary, though. The last one I, horror movie I just watched was Get Out. Watched that like a week ago. Um, that's a good one. I'll have to watch that. Is that a, good, is that a new one? Because if this is a theater, I'm probably not going to have time to go and see it. Not that I don't want to. Oh, we got another white code card. Dark Ray's your favorite. Yeah, Dark Ray's pretty cool. Not gonna lie. We got a water. Yeah, that was that was a sweet pull. Oh, D Spirits. Yes, I cannot wait to open up some D Spirits. It's um probably end of December, I'm guessing. I guess they had a little bit of delays. They're hoping for early December, but it looks like uh Sometime between December 8th and December 25th, those packs are going to come in. Oh, we got a shiny dark ray on Pokemon Go? Wow. Congrats. I got I got a pretty good Pokemon Go collection going. I mean, probably not as good as most people because I don't get to travel much. But Oh, okay. We're just bringing the hits all of a sudden. So Galio GX, that's a nice looking card. Not as cool as that dark ray, but it's still pretty cool. <laughs> Am I married? Yes. <laughs> Not jealous. It's okay. It's okay if you are. I still love you. David, hey! <laughs> but yes, I am married. Oh, do I have another white code card right now? So this is Rebel Clash. And I have another white code card. Some of these tins can be nuts. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I just got this. Although I ordered it. It's way too big because I forget I'm not a size large anymore. But yeah, these are my old pants. And even though I pull them super tight, they're like falling off me. I got to buy... I read it was on Hulu. I'll have to give that a watch. Maybe I'll watch it tonight before I pass out, but I can't stay up late. <laughs> but yes, yeah, so this is another white code card. So we got Full Heel, Training Court... The Blade, Litwick. I'm excited to see what this is. Oh, that Galarian Cursal is so sad. <laughs> yes, Rebel Clash. Um, white code card for Rebel Clash. Um, I'm going to do a hit recap in a little bit. Um, oh, I want Gold Frozmoth so bad. That's like the one card I want to pull so bad from this set. Oh, it's a hollow Galarian Surfetched. Hey, Rachel, how you doing? What's my favorite shiny Pokemon? That is a very good question. I don't even know if I can answer that. I, I'm probably going to say Sylveon or Umbreon. Umbreon's really cool because of the colors that it winds up getting. 
Dragapult V or VMAX. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if I, um, oh, I hope you do. Hey, Goku, how you doing? Uh, Nino, if you get a uh, card shop, that's very cool. Where are you going to open it? Because I would love to come and see it. Another white code card. This this tan is like all white code cards so far. And that's four out of five packs. And this is Vivid Voltage. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, how are you doing, Goku, my friend? So yeah, my favorite one would probably be Shiny Umbreon. Did you miss any good pulls here? We'll do a quick recap. Uh, so I opened a Celebrations ETB and now I'm on a Pikachu tin. <laughs> so Galio GX. This Darkrai is pretty sweet. It's got the texture on it. Um, it was from uh, Burning Shadows, I think. Oh, man, it's, yeah, this Stoutland too. That's a really nice Stoutland. We got this Garchomp C. I haven't pulled that one yet, so that's good. Gold Charizard. Straight up dud box. No, my friend. That's so sad. I'm so sorry. I, I just picked one up today, actually. I picked up that box. I'm not opening it tonight. I'm going to open it on next week's live, but uh, I can't wait to open it. Here comes Team Rocket. I want a Rocket Zap. Oh, I need Rocket Zapdos. That's another one I need. And then Claydol. So those were the hits so far. And this pack has a white code card, so we'll see what this one gets. Pokemon hunting, watching this beautiful stream. Oh, nice. I hope you find some stuff. That style is so cool. I love the colors on that. We got an Excadrill. We got a Clavifus. We got a Woobat. Tallow. <laughs> Everybody knows Charizard Chaser, even though he's... I feel like a lot of people do. Even though he's a smaller channel. Love that channel. I have two boxes coming in. Going to keep one sealed. Yeah, there you go. I like to keep one sealed and open one. So we got a reverse uncommon dust gloves and a Pikachu V. Okay. Pikachu V, how you doing? Do I sell cards I pulled? No, I um I don't sell anything I, I really have. I can kind of one hand the time I've sold things in five years, and that's just because somebody really wanted it. Um I just I like to keep my stuff. It's my collection, so I really don't. I don't sell my stuff. I have a lot of people ask, and it's just not its not worth my time to really sell stuff, especially since I love it all. Two Celebrated Premium Collections. I found one of those today, too. I found that and the Charizard box. Oh, the first green code card of the box, but it is Vivid Voltage. We can still get an amazing rare. So premium boxes are expensive. Did I get the Ultra Premium Collection? No, I got the Pikachu uh, Figure Collection. I haven't found the Ultra Premium Collection. Lancet Charizard, yeah. So I do. I did get one of those. I opened that. I think. I think it was on OnlyFans last week, maybe. The Lancet Charizard box. Beldum. We got little baby elephant. Duskull. Electric. We got a reverse rare Zygarde, so no amazing rare. And then this Quagsire. Oh, Quagsire. Of course, you're going to come on in and uh, be Quagsire. So what we can open next, you guys let me know in the comments what you want. I have Chilling Rain ETBs. I have the Greninja and Zacian V Union boxes. And I have a big spider on my wall. I don't like that. And uh, Flareon, Jolteon, and Vaporeon tin. So you guys let me know in the comments what you think I should open. I'm going to open a bit of Yu-Gi-Oh! Evolving Skies. So I might have Evolving Skies in those uh, those tin, the Jolteon. Um, yeah, that's probably a little bit of everything. It's probably Chilling Rain and Evolving Skies. Yeah, so I might as well go with those tins then. I will open this Yu-Gi-Oh! pack and then move on to that. Yeah, so storing sealed collections can be tough because, like, they obviously take up a lot of space. Sometimes you want to display them. So this is Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu -Oh! King's Court. It's a really fun set. I think all the cards are rare. Yeah, this this is good, Yu-Gi-Oh! right here. This is the good stuff. I'm going to get that up nice and close so you guys can see that. Oh, I, I mean, like I said, I haven't talked about Yu-Gi-Oh! much because I'm just, like, getting back into it. But the art is so good. And I got some cool vintage ones I'm going to open uh, next week. Well, not vintage, like 2016, 2017. The Wicked Avatar. Unexpected Die. The Warrior Returning Alive. Magnet Induction. And I really, I do like the hollow pattern on Yu-Gi-Oh! It's very vibrant. Oh, thank you. Show me that love. Uh, okay, so we are going for... These bad boys. 
I'll probably do a little more Yu-Gi-Oh! Close out the night after that. So, uh, once again, thank you all for coming and watching this fun little opening. Was well, pretty impulsive, but uh, you got two booster boxes, David. What'd you get? I'm gonna keep a lot of my celebration sealed if I never open my 20th. Yeah, so I haven't opened my 20th anniversary stuff. Oh, maximum gold. Yeah, so I have that. I think sitting on my shelf. Char first edition Charizard with no. Okay, so you have that Vaporeon promo that comes with this. So I haven't opened any of these yet. Um. This is super sweet. That promo there. I'll set that aside. No, there was rarities until one month ago. Hey, it happens. It happens. So we have four packs, and it does meet both requests. We have Evolving Skies, Chilling Rain, Battle Styles, and Sword Shield Base. Yeah, the promo is pretty for Vaporeon. And we have a green coat guard. It's okay. They can't all be winners. Still need the Flareon tin. Yeah, so you want to get like one of each of those because you want to get those promos. Uh, they're not going to be in the best shape, but if you get a clean one, you know, hopefully uh, your promo is not damaged. I heard a lot of them are damaged. Ooh, that Rhydon's looking good. Potion. So yeah, I have uh, two of each. Red Hot Turtle Shell. <laughs> I'm glad you noticed that. I, I I get comments on a lot of the other stuff, but usually not the the uh, Mario Kart turtle shell there. The Koopa shell, we should call it. Clavipus. Uh, reverse Diglett. Look at that little guy. He's, he's just like, uh, life is what it is. Eh, Diglett. And then we got a uh, Rylaboom. <laughs> Oh, you pull pull both Marnies. Well, congrats. A Mario Kart stream? I would definitely do a Mario Kart stream. Yeah, so when I put that poll up the other day on my page, I was very happy to see that you guys wanted some video game content because that's really the direction I want to go in. So we have we have a white code card. <laughs> See, I don't know how I have self-control to keep anything sealed. I mean, I've been opening just, you know, mostly Sword and Shield era stuff, but I do have a decent sealed collection. And I don't want to rip through it because, you know, YouTube, if I run out of cards, I'm going to be kind of sad. <laughs> how am I going to... Well, when will T-Spirits not be able to buy? Um, so for D-Spirits, um, the uh, booster boxes should be shipping end of December. So I'm hoping to have it before Christmas. I we're probably not going to get till January if I had to guess with delays. But uh, you should buy a Switch to play Sword Shield. Yeah, so I have a Switch and I love playing um, Sword and Shield. And I do want to stream. Oh, we got a Mawile Reverse and Flapple V Max. Look at that big bad boy! I guess the textured full art right there. That's super cool. My favorite amiibo. Hmm. I mean, I would say my Luigi in the front there, because that's actually a kind of pricey hard to get Luigi. Uh, so I think that's one of my favorites. Uh, oh, Baby Bowser right here. That's a good one. That's one of my faves. Oh, I love this Wario, too. I've been playing the WarioWare a little bit. That's a good game. <laughs> but yeah, this Luigi's actually... It was a lot of money a while ago. I can only imagine what he costs now. Yeah, Wario's a lot of fun. So now we got some Chilling Rain. Yeah, Pokemon Red... I can you play Pokemon right on the Switch? See, I have the DS to play um, play it emulated on the go, and then I could also emulate it on my computer. And I also own physical copies, of course. Yeah, that particular Luigi. So there's the, the Luigi where he looks like he's shooting out of the cannon. Um, where is he? I know I have that one, too, I think. Or maybe I don't have it out, but... That Luigi is not worth what that one is. And Luigi, Luigi's the man. But yeah, keep an eye out for that Luigi if you ever see it. Because I think that one was at least 50 bucks. You know, a couple years ago. 
I say like three years ago. Thwacky. Score Bunny. Come on. Chilling Rain. Chilling Rain. Cub Fu. Blitzel. Quillfish. Thank you very much. We got a reverse Steenie and. Oh, okay. Another V Max. We got Tornadus V Max. That's a nice one. Yeah, so I got to figure out how to stream from my actual Switch. So it's really simple. You get a cam link, open it up and stream. Let's play. I got to figure out the cam link part because I was going to just, you know, stream an emulator on my screen and then I got to get it all set up to do that. And I'm hoping to do that within the next couple of weeks for real. And then we're ending on an Evolving Skies Green code card for that tin. We got two more tins and then we'll be calling it a night. All been like one Yu Gi Oh pack as a finale, but. Lombre, little face guard, Hypno, Pokemon TCG Online. I play that like crazy. So, Camlink, it's a hundred dollars. Helps give the best quality. Oh, okay, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely buy that. Do I have any pets? I do not. I uh, work just way too much to have any pets to take care of. I mean, I, I work crazy hours. I can work uh, 40 hours in three days or more, you know, it's just in three days or less, I should say. So I, I just, I typically work Saturday, Sunday, Monday, um, but also sometimes Friday. And it's just straight 14 hour days sometimes. Braviary. Reverse. I mean, uh, reverse Braviary and then a non hollow Drampa. So, yeah, we're going to do the Flareon and the Jolteon as well. Oh, how do you play Retro Game on the Switch? I feel like you probably can. But, yeah, the Cam Link, I will, I will grab that up. Sounds like a worthy investment for 100 bucks. But I play the Retro Games, like I said, on the DS. I think you can get, like, hacked DSs or something. So we got that nice Jolteon. TCGs, I particularly, well, I do like magic cards. I have magic cards, um, quite a few of them. Oh, is that a, okay. Hi, Sailor Teal. Well, tell your cat I said hello. Hello. Good to see you. Glad you made it. I'm not going to be streaming too much longer. I got two more things. And I got to try to get to bed early, actually. So we got Baldic Skies, Chilling Rain, Battle Styles, and Sword and Shield, just like the other 10. Soul Silver is the best game ever. I still have my original copy that I bought new from Walmart, and it's like one of my favorite games of all time, ever, ever. I replayed it during my COVID lockdown, and right now I got to get through Platinum. All these squares make a circle. <laughs> What do I do for work for 14 hours? I am a manager at a strip club. And it's it, I can range from having to do everything from, uh, you know, DJing to, um, you know, taking care of the girls and running bottle service. And it's just a very, it's a very long, uh, the weekends are very crazy there. During the week is very quiet. I got, a, I mostly ditched my Friday for Monday, but you know, being in charge of the parties and stuff. Like we're having a huge party tomorrow with a $5,000 costume contest prize. So I I'm in charge of the party and I, I got to be there. <laughs> um, I'm probably gonna have to go in very early and I'm hoping to not stay late. Cause I got to work Saturday. Snom reverse and a Kramer non hollow rear. So yeah, it's very exhausting being in the club for that long. Let's cut through UPC based. Oh, Oh, I wish you would have stayed put. Oh, love you too, my friend. Oh, we got another green co car. Maybe this tin's not as fun as the other one. I need some fire poles. Well, you have a wonderful night, my friend. We got fire. It's nice to see so many people here, though. Spirit mask. Palpitoad. Gold duck. Yeah, the music. Yeah, when I'm the DJ, the music's great. I promise. Swablu. <laughs> Although I'm sure everybody would say that. Uh, unfortunately with my job being so weird, I have to play whatever the owner says. And he has a playlist of like 23 songs. And, uh, sometimes I got to play that was first line at 6am. Then when I came back, it's, I was seventh in line. Thought something was up. No one was there. Oh, oh, I wish you would have gotten that. 
Music's your thing. All right, Pokemon Legacy, I will see you soon. Thank you for stopping by. I love video game music. I wish I could play that. Cool. Have a wonderful night. I'm glad you made it in. Oh, I feel bad that you missed out on that. I, I probably was like close to getting one at Walmart. A few people beat me at Walmart today. But they restock on Thursdays. <laughs> I love you guys. You are awesome. So we're hoping to get some fire out of this battle styles. I mean, um, no, this was up. This one's I think it's Sword Shield, yeah, Sword Shield or something. Well, oh no, maybe Evolving Skies. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, we'll find out. Chilling Rain, maybe. Weedle doing crunches, working on his abs. Cast form. Mareep and Greed and Hollow Rare. Okay, Battle Styles. You better give me that sleeping Tyranitar. Then we're going to open our last Pokemon 10. We're going to open that uh, Flareon. I think I just opened the Jolteon. Yeah, I did. All right, we got a Green Goker. No, this tin was not the fire I wanted. Thank you so much, Bronx. I'm so glad that you stopped by. I appreciate you so much. Like I said, as always, Crawdunt, Electabuzz, Lickitung, Cheruby, Horsey, Murkrow, Galarian, Slowpoke Reverse. I love him. Of course, I love my Slowpokes. Gotta love the slow pokes. <laughs> and then Aegis Slash Non Hollow Rare. Battle Styles was not bringing the fire. Never does. All right, last 10 here. We got Flareon. Can we get some heat? Oh my God. Yeah. Charizard Chaser. Yes. I wish the casinos did because it is literally a gamble. Like, I feel like a. Hey, Poke Cards Kev, good to see you. I need some of that last 10 luck. You pulled two Urshifu, Urshifu alternate arts. Yeah, so I haven't pulled any of those. I'm dying to pull them. There's like so many things out of Battle Styles that I need, need. You got Flareon promo, which is also very nice. Bring that fire, Flareon. We need that last 10 luck. Yeah, if the casino sold sports cards, like that's that's where I'd be. I'd be I'd be stuck there. And I already feel like a gambler because like I said, I open these tins. Oh, mushroom, thank you. Yes, I wanna um I wanna stream at least once a week. I would have done it tomorrow, but I have to work, so um I will not be here. So I'm doing it tonight. Figured you guys probably wouldn't mind it pulls the stream, but I want to make it a like routine time thing that so people know to show up at a certain time. Hello, Trax Phantom. Good to see you. I like your little emojis. Battle style singers are cheap. Yes, yes. So, Beavis, I would love to buy some battle style singles while they are cheap. Uh, so I could finish off that set. I probably have every common and uncommon, but I just don't have the big hitters. I cannot pull the big hitters. We got a puff pup. We got a Psyduck. Rufflet. Lombre. Lilligant. That's it for that pack. Dud, dud, dud. Oh, yes. If I one day can see us start doing box breaks, because it's it literally is gambling. Yes, you're right. You are right. <sighs> trade me some cards. I don't know what I have for trade. I mean, if somebody is oh, another green one out of Chilling Rain. Chilling Rain, I just want a good hit. I just want a... And, you know, I feel like a gambler Walmart. You know, I'm just sitting there. I'm looking at the shelves. I can only buy a few things. What am I betting my money on? So Pokemon cards is very much like gambling. World of Peed. Yeah, maybe we could trade. I, I would definitely prefer to do that in person. Um, if you're local to me, if you're in Connecticut, I would definitely trade with you. Um, Bill Rockruff. Swirlix. Lapras. Deerling, reverse Deerling. I always think it's so weird when they come back to back. And a Doug Trio non hollow rare battle styles. Oh, you're in Los Angeles. Yeah, so I'm in Connecticut. Yes, the <laughs> Sailor Moon. Yeah, so after Run Award, that sounds about right. 
Uh, I just put the shirt. I didn't realize it was going to be so big on me because I lost so much weight. I mean, these pants I've been wearing for four years, they don't even fit. I look like I'm wearing like a like a paper bag right now. So I got to buy all new clothes. Offer up could do that possibly. Um, okay, did I do the card? One, two, three, four. Looks like it was a white coat card out of this one. Hello, 406. Good to see you. Um, if you haven't already, definitely, if you like nice, relaxing videos, check out 406 Findings. Um, love the rock videos. Um, Jody, who's a moderator too, has a great channel. Um, definitely think you guys should check him out. But 406, I love your rock videos. They're, they're so nice. You're a little exploring, picking up the rocks. I love that. I don't do videos like that, but I would if I could. Get to agree. Hey, there you go. That's actually a good idea. I, I, if I was um trying to lose weight, I probably would have given myself some incentive like that. L style booster boxes with run of print always have alt arts because alt arts are one of the product. Like, ooh, that's super cool. Hound Doom reverse rare. Oh, oh, what a card! Look at the colors on that. Okay, I'll have to come and take a look. If you can leave a link in the comments, that'd be handy for me to watch it after. That Corvin Knight V. Oh, look at those colors. Oh, that, that is worthy of a sleeve. The colors on this are stunning. Oh, I wish Pokemon cards weren't so valuable so I could just stick this one in my wallet and look at it anytime I just need a little smile. Like, oh, it's so nice. <laughs> Sword and shield. Yeah, so that's, that was a good hit out of this 10. I'll take that. I don't know. I'm sure it's not very valuable, but uh, we got another white card, white code card out of sword and shield. Can this bring the fire? We will find out. Fire. Poke kid. We need last pack magic. Thank you. Thank you. That was a great pull. Double. We will end on a Yu-Gi-Oh pack. Crabby. Chincho, Baltoy, Nicket, Vulpix. Oh, thank you so much. Hoot Hoot and Professor's Research. That's like the cursed hollow. So that's it for Pokemon. We're going to do a, one more Yu-Gi-Oh pack here. And yeah, this is King's Court. So I think all the cards are rare. Hey! Sky is not our limit. It's just our starting point. I love that. Good to see you. Good to see you. I'm so happy so many people have made it to the lives. I mean, we had 20 something people in here at one point. That was super cool. Okay, Yu-Gi-Oh. Hello. Hello. Navi Trooper Gaming. Good to see you. Welcome, welcome. So we have... Oh, these cards are so cool. Wicked Dreadroot. I hope you guys can see these cards good too. We have the... Wicked Eraser. Oh, you're on your lunch break? Oh, wow. What time zone are you in? Are you in uh, Europe or Australia? Or Well, no, that would be like breakfast. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I'm curious. Pendulum. Arcana. Night Joker. Oh, okay. Oh, well, you have a good evening, my friend. But yeah, Pokemon Waifu. Oh, thank you. Some nice pulls tonight for sure. Yes, you have a blessed night as well. So this is going to be our hollow out of Yu-Gi-Oh. I'm loving me some Yu-Gi-Oh packs. We could do a pull recap. And then if anybody has any questions for me, feel free to ask them. It's Corviknight V. Amazing. See you soon, my friend. Greedent, Tornadus VMAX, Flapple VMAX, Pikachu. Oh, you are so welcome. Thank you for sharing these pulls with me. It's always more fun to open Pokemon cards with your friends. Why open them alone? Share the experience. If you don't have a YouTube channel one, you should start it just to share your cards with you. I will open cards with you on Zoom if you want. We could do it together. We could put on YouTube together. I just would love to just share all of that with you guys. You know, I don't know if you noticed, I've been putting out uh, videos with Lou and we did our pack battle ETB and uh, we did our prize video yesterday. If you haven't seen that yet, definitely take a look. And uh, yeah, so if you want to get your channel started, I would love to uh, give you guys a shout out and work with you on that because I think everybody should chase their dreams. 
Yeah, so all the colors of the rainbow. I love me rainbows. I love me some good rainbows. And then Galarian Surfetch. So yeah, there's some really cool pulls tonight. Uh, my favorite definitely has to be that Dark Rye, that Stoutland, that Garchomp. There's another really cool one. Oh, the Corbin Knight. Yeah. So these are these these ones are my top. Right here. These are my four faves of the night. Those really cool looking cards. I love the textured full arts from the Sword Shield era because they just made the background so vibrant. The rainbow style. Yes, I was hoping to get a rainbow rare tonight, but we did not. Yeah, so if anybody has any questions, ask them. Want to see some more amiibos? <laughs> any more Dragon Ball packs? Oh, I do have one. I should open one. I think I have one some more on my desk. I mean, I feel like we might as well open it while we're here. Because those Dragon Ball cards are so sweet. Just even, so what I could say about Dragon Ball cards is I really, really like them. Uh, I'm newer to these two. I bought these before I started buying the Yu-Gi-Oh! Half gold and half rainbows. Oh my god, imagine if the Charizard was gold and the background was rainbow and he was flying out of a rainbow. That'd be the coolest thing ever. I want that card so bad now. <laughs> Gyron the Avenger. Oh, that sounds amazing. Yeah, so if you look at these um, Dragon, Dragon Ball Super cards, you'll just see, you know, just even these common cards have great art to them. Um, the, the thickness of the cards is very nice. They feel very sturdy. Of course, the great art. Okay, so now you have an idea for the new card, Pokemon Card Company. I hope you're listening. We want that gold Charizard flying out of a rainbow. Make it happen. <laughs> Thank you so much for stopping by, Goku. I hope to see you next week. Unlikely Protector. Yeah, that'd be a custom card. Like, I wish I, I knew how to make those custom cards. Oh, yeah, like, look at this Concord. Way too cool. But uh, I'm so happy. Oh, that one's cool. Teamwork of the Universe 7. And yeah, that's got a nice hollow on it. And then behind it's going to be a rare. I need, yeah, I need to figure out how to play Dragon Ball. Uh, so we have an Android 13. I want Android 18. I love Android 18. Can't seem to pull that one much as I want to. I think I got one more, one more Dragon Ball pack now. I'm so hooked on the Dragon Ball. Oh yes, the Majin Buu. Oh, you should do a custom. If Pokemon opened a casino, a <laughs> poker box. Well, we were talking earlier, I think before you got here, that um, they should sell Pokemon cards at the casino because it is like literally gambling when we buy Pokemon cards. Uh, Android 17. Where's my Android 18? Vegeta the Brawler. Oh, well, thank you, Charles Manson. <laughs> I'm glad you care more about that than I do. Ooh, we got Dr. Mew, Return from the Beyond. That's a nice hollow there. And uh, the rare is Sun Gohan. Yeah. Yeah, you caught me live just as I'm leaving. <laughs> Hi, Bob. Good to see you. Bob and I have to play NES games together. Just saying. That story you were telling me earlier about your dad and your paycheck. I love that. I love that. Oh, my God. Those are like the best memories you never forget. I, I don't forget um, my first NES game. I was three years old. I was my N64. I remember getting it on release day with Super Mario 64. And we were at home. We were just watching in amazement. We're, we just thought the whole game was groundbreaking. We're watching this. And we're like, no way. We just walked around, walked around. And... <laughs> <laughs> we were just in the first level. We just couldn't even handle it, the Nintendo 64. And then I never had a Super Nintendo, so I just played NES and 64 and Sega Genesis. I didn't get a Super Nintendo until I was older. And, oh, do I love it now, being older. Um, but, yeah, so I'm very much looking forward to start streaming with you guys some older games. I was just so happy to see the results of the polls that people want me to play video games on here. I can't wait to do it. It's something I've been wanting to do. Now that I have the good computer, I can set that up and do it. 
got a microphone. I got all that stuff. But uh, I will see you guys later. I'm going to say bye for now and take care. And thank you all so much for coming out. I'm going to do this, like I said, at least once a week. Once I start doing games, probably two or three times a week. P T PSA 10 Pokemon Evolutions Mega Charizard. Oh, my Instagram. Uh, it is... Um, Oh, it's the same as YouTube, the confusing words. So TikTok, YouTube, subreddit. I mean, I don't use that. But yes, um, Instagram is the confusing words. You have a wonderful rest of your night. Big shout out to my mods. I love you guys. I love all of you. Thank you. Thank you. And I hope you have a wonderful Halloween. I'll keep you guys updated probably with some fun pictures and stuff of mine. How hard they were back then. Yes, thank you, thank you. Have a good night, Bob. Bye, everybody. I'm just waiting. I know there's like bad latency there. I didn't put on the ultra low. Bye, everybody. Bye. <laughs> oh, I gotta block that one guy. Hold on. There we go. All right, now I can leave. <laughs>